about 70% of women are at significant risks for cardiovascular disease. The issues of cardiovascular health that come up in a pregnancy can be several fold because they're often a window to a woman's future and so we need to keep an eye on that for sure. One of the things that we worry most about is preeclampsia. Preeclampsia is a range of symptoms including high blood pressure, protein in the urine, and swelling. Blood pressure is becoming more common in pregnancy, especially in women who are of older reproductive age. Things that we worry about in pregnancy is advanced maternal age, obesity, we worry about people who smoke. Those things all play a part in developing high blood pressure in pregnancies and the problems that can occur with such. So there's several ways to modify your risks for developing cardiovascular disease in pregnancy. Certainly a healthy diet is probably the number one thing that we can do. We do see racial disparities when we're talking about high blood pressure in pregnancy. Black women tend to have high blood pressure over any of their counterparts, be it pre-existing high blood pressure, meaning high blood pressure prior to pregnancy, or even developing it during pregnancy, black women are going to be more at risk for that. It's extremely important for women to go to their doctor prior to getting pregnant because oftentimes they won't have any symptoms or even feel any different when they have high blood pressure. And it would be very important to get on medication for your high blood pressure prior to getting pregnant. Preparing for a healthy pregnancy is really important. There are many things that women can do to increase a good outcome for their pregnancy. If you're obese, lose some weight. If you have high blood pressure, take your medicines as prescribed. That's really critically important. If you smoke, please stop smoking. Get your vaccines. Extremely important to be up to date on your vaccines. Exercise and diet are always critically important to a pregnancy. And those are things that certainly you can control to help the outcome for a healthy pregnancy.